trying out a dashboard test of regular PLA versus the Raptor PLA. The regular PLA is very soft. I'm sure the darker blue does absorb a little bit more energy. The Raptor PLA is soft but does kind of return to its natural shape or printed shape. The regular PLA does hold the deformation. This is an annealed thinner version, the thin version of the regular PLA. The annealed version, I didn't notice much difference. Unannealed again, regular PLA, a thicker version. A little soft. Very flexible. Wouldn't be very good to mount a uh, phone or whatnot on your dashboard if you use the plastic, because if you leave it in your car, it would get soft. The Raptor is better, but it's no ABS. Again, unannealed, annealed, not much difference. PETG, supposedly glow in the dark. Doesn't glow very well, but it is a pretty good PETG. Regular PLA, very soft, a thicker version. Thicker version of the PETG, great for dashboard automotive parts. But again, it's clear, so it's not absorb as much energy as the darker colors. The Raptor PLA, again, you can see is a bit soft. Might get a buy for some projects, but it's definitely not as stiff as ABS plastic or PETG. Here's some black ABS plastic that I got years ago, and you can see it is flexible like regular PL or ABS without snapping, but the heat doesn't affect it that much. But the black Raptor PLA is actually more of a dark charcoal, the initial versions that I got, very noodly. ABS doesn't noodle like that.